Sheriff Michelle Cook confirming the arrest of that deputy who has 26 years at the Clay County Sheriff's Office, Timothy James Bell. The arrest this morning stemming from an investigation that started in late October after Clay Sheriff employees reported Bell for allegedly committing fraud in his secondary employment. Cook saying that Bell was supposed to be doing work on the side, which was assigned by a coordinator by a coordinator from the sheriff's office. Jobs like handling security and property checks for outside groups or companies like the Clay County Utility Authority, Duval Asphalts, and the Fleming Island Plantation Amenity Center. According to Cook, covert surveillance operations in November revealed Bell at five different jobs either did not finish the work or didn't even show up at all, but submitted records to get paid for the work anyways. The sheriff says at one point, Bell even submitted timesheets for two additional jobs with overlapping hours on different sides of the county. None of us want our badge to be tarnished by the misdeeds of others, and we understand the importance of public trust. This is a solemn obligation that we are sworn as professionals, we are sworn to as professionals, and I am committed personally as the sheriff of the Clay County Sheriff's Office. Cook said Bell cashed checks for those five jobs amounting to more than $1,300 the record submitted through his Clay County Sheriff's Office computer. She said uh, she also added that he has been fired from his job here at the Clay County Sheriff's Office now facing that organized fraud charge, which is considered a third degree felony in the state of Florida. We're live in Green Cove Springs. David Jones, First Coast News on your side. David.